Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on April 8th, 2023. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to a quick video update here, a space weather update, as our sun has produced two M-class solar flares over the past 48 hours. Having a look here at the last 48 hours of SDO imagery, 304 angstroms we can see the bottom left-hand side. This is where we produced the first M-class solar flare another M-class solar flare on the bottom right-hand side, <clears throat> as well as a couple destabilizing filaments, creating a solar tsunami in the Northern Hemisphere. But most notable here is a couple ejections from the Southern and Northern Hemisphere, and as well a large plasma filament, Northeast region of our sun, putting on quite a show and a dance and a couple twirls. Just some amazing imagery here from SDO right now at our sun with two M-class solar flares being reported the last 48 hours, three active sunspot regions are facing and some plasma filaments. Another closer look here at that dancing filament in the northeast region of our sun. Amazing as it stands up to possibly eight to 10 Earths tall. And look at those loops and swoops. Happy Easter, everybody. I hope you're all enjoying a safe and happy weekend with family members. Much love to you all, and I thank you all for tuning in. Having a look at multi spectrum, the last 48 hours of events, we do have one coronal hole to talk about equatorial region. Don't mind those little black flashes. SDO satellite going through calibration, which it does every so often. And these are the effects. Much love to you all. And thank you for watching today. This is a quick space weather update. Not too much is happening in the way of earthquakes or weather right now. Not much has changed since last update here at 171 angstroms another closer look at that northeast region as well just some amazing images here with SDO so these solar flares were not in an earth facing direction and they did not produce CMEs well the most recent one did it was a minor CME but not earth facing said to give us a glancing blow in the coming days with the already accelerated solar wind stream, which we are expecting from pretty much today into the 10th of April. So heads up, stay safe, everybody. Stay aware and prepared. Earthquakes are sitting at about 250 earthquakes the past 24 hours. Space weather conditions are low right now. Solar winds 350 kilometers per second. Solar X-ray flux remains in a high B range after shooting off those two M-class solar flares. Having a look here at the last 48 hours of events from LASCO, showing lots of energy coming from the southwest limb, southeast limb, and then that northeast region where that plasma filament was dancing around. Again, I want to thank you all for tuning in today. Hope you enjoy the video updates. And please don't forget that there is an earthquake live stream going. You can always come in and check up on our planet, check up on earthquakes or anything else. Just get into the comments section and tell us what you're looking for. ISWA Space Prediction Spiral showing that small CME, giving us a glancing blow into the 12th and 13th quick look here at the frequency absorption map showing cosmic energy penetrating during these last couple solar flares again much love everybody stay aware and prepared stay young and have fun and get your daily do and go, 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 go. if you enjoyed today's video please hit that like button subscribe share with your friends and family from across the world